Let's do connections. We're finding four groups of four. Initial here for the Wii theme. They spelled Wii wrong. Um, endorse Maiden, Premier Champion. Sign support, Banner Use, First Poster, and Back Billboard. Hmm. All right. <laughs> what, what stood out to me here? Like Premier, like the beginning of something, the first, the Premier, the... Um, like what else would mean that, though? Initial, obviously. What's the other one, though? Banner, maybe? See, these being the first, initial premier first, banner is like, like if it's the, it's the one that's on the banner, right? It's, it's the one that uh, is the, the most famous or the most hyped, which is usually not the first one. I might go with it anyway, but so we've got endorse and sign and initial, and I feel like those could go together as well, although they are all on top of each other. But like you endorse and you sign, those are both ways of just giving your permission. You can initial for that as well. Um, so maybe I should hold off and see if I can figure out some of these other categories. Um, endorse, sign, and back, I think, would go together. Now, would it be initial or would it be support? I think, I think these go together. So I think initial is safe to go with first and premiere. Let's find out. No, one away. So maybe not sign then. Maybe sign and initial go with other things. So we're endorsing, we're supporting, we're backing, and we're... They picked some categories that feel really similar, and that always makes these harder. You're going you're gonna to just get a lot of one-aways, I think, on this one, but let's see. Um, I like these three together. I can't figure out the fourth one. It seems pretty usual for me lately. Endorse, support, back. Maybe banner, like I described, but that, that doesn't... It's not the right part of speech. You know what I mean? I endorse him. I support him. I back him. I don't banner him. Maybe. You can be a bannerman. Champion. You champion them. Okay, there we go. I kept thinking of champion as the, the noun, but it can also be a verb. Advocate for. There we go. So we still have um, first, premier, and initial. Banner is still around. But I'm still not confident about that. I, I don't have that many mistakes to use up here. Um, all right. So let's think about something else. Let's think about we here. Isn't that like uh, just means small? I don't know what else would mean small. So maybe we're maybe we're word playing at this point. That would be unfortunate. I don't think I want to think about that right now then. Maiden is interesting too. I feel like the, the ones that kind of stand out is like, what is this doing here? Like maiden, we. Ooh, I just I just noticed billboard, banner, poster, and sign. I think that's what we've got. Okay, that's probably the yellow. <laughs> yeah, advertising format. Okay, I don't know why it took me it 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 took me a bit to see that for some reason. Um, okay, so we still have first, premiere, and initial. Banner's gone. Good thing I didn't try to put it in there. Maiden, like the maiden voyage. There we go. Okay, so what is the purple doing? Oh, I, I just realized I'm wearing my plus two to blue shirt, which is why I got blue first. It makes sense. All right, use theme here and we. Okay, so this is, um, would you call that? Yeah, a pro pronouns with an E at the end. Us, them, her, and we. So pronouns with an E at the end. Pronoun plus E. There we go. I knew it had to be wordplay. All right, just one little mistake there. Um, which is fine. Cool. Well, how'd you do? Let's do the mini crossword for Saturday, May 25th. And I like to remind every Saturday that the Saturday puzzle does end early. The Sunday one comes in earlier. So if your puzzle's different, check. It might be the Sunday one. That means you missed Saturday. If you have a subscription, you can go back and do Saturday. If not, there's not really a way to do it. But I'm going to get started right now. All right. Crack of the blank. Sweet sound for a baseball lover. Crack of the bat, then, I guess. Did some road work. Worked. No. Um, I'm not sure. What tonic water was originally used to treat? Cholera? Fits. It's not cholera. I'll leave that for a second. There's, it was a disease. Um, obviously, that's what that's. <laughs> Malaria. Malaria, right? The fact that cholera fit is <laughs> was bad. All right, and so forth for short, etc. Maybe Tyrannosaurus Rex. 
All right, sorry, you just missed it. All right, I don't think we're going to be able to get that without the downs. Served cool as a summer beverage. Lemonade? Nope. Um, water? <laughs> no. Okay. Like documents in Microsoft Word. Um, text. Not sure. Outdoor space for a high-rise apartment. A balcony. Okay, et cetera, et cetera is correct. Selma director Duvernay. Abe? <laughs> I don't know. Um, outdoor space for a high-rise apartment. Oh, a terrace. Isn't that the same? It's the same clue twice. That's funny. Uh, tushy. I don't know. I want to put behind or something. Um, huh. Yeah, I, I don't know what goes there. That's a problem. Followed a paleo regimen, say. A diet. Dieted. Right, because followed is past tense. So if he followed a paleo regimen, then he dieted. All right. Convened. Met. <coughs> also past tense. Tool for a lumber gel. I mean, they would still use an axe, right? <laughs> uh, powder's prominent feature. The frown. Um, what? I don't know. Three-letter feature. The eye? Okay, let's go back to these. Did some road work. Gated? See, I thought this might be a B for Abe. Abed. Um, I don't know what that would be, so probably not a B then. Sorry you just missed it. Too late. All right. <laughs> At least I got something. Served cool as a summer be beverage? Huh? What's 11 down? Powder's prominent feature. The lip, I guess. Okay. Is this like anise or something? This is typed. Type documents are typed. What's this down? Tushy. Is it like two some? Well, this is a problem. <laughs> some of director, I don't know. And I don't think it's Abe, although it could be. Tushy. That's the word for your butt, right? <laughs> is it like bat out? I, what's this drink served cool? Eunice or I'm thinking it's I'm thinking it's bat out. Did some road work though. I wonder if bat is appearing three times. No. Okay. I was, I was thinking bat, bat, bat. <laughs> um, darn. I don't think his name is eight or her. I don't even know who directed Selma. So I don't think their name is eight. Um, I don't know why bat out would mean tushy anyway, but I don't know what this is. Um, I guess I'll check. Oh, I got a lot wrong. Okay. It's the three I thought were wrong. Well, actually I didn't. Yeah, I thought that you might be wrong. Did I spell malaria wrong? I did spell malaria wrong. Is it Ada? This isn't an, a U, so A E. I think anise is something. I don't know what it means though. Maybe it's a, it's a cool beverage. Um, fate. I did some road work. Waited, rated, tated, hated. I'm not sure this is right. Let's check what we've got. No, these are both wrong. <laughs> oh no. Um, so I tried A and U here. It could have also been unnice. <laughs> um. Wait, I was thinking, oh, I was thinking caboose here, but obviously these letters are correct, so it can't be caboose. Wow. I just, I just don't know. I might have to just use the checker to get these because I, I basically failed this puzzle. So it's not A or U, so it's E or I or O. E doesn't make sense for the down. So O or I. O or I. I wish I could figure out what this did some road work means. What's the, what kind of road work are we talking about? Paved, maybe. There we go. Had to think about kinds of road work. Um, I don't think I've heard of Onis. I'm going to look up Onis and then also Patoot. Really? <laughs> Who says that? Okay. Uh, and then Ava. Ava makes sense. I don't know why I didn't think about that. Yeah, let's look up Onis. Okay, so it's on ice. <laughs> Onis does is some kind of precious stone, but that didn't make any sense. So on ice. <sighs> okay. Well, <laughs> how'd you do? Let's do strands for May 25th. Today's theme is sounds delicious. What sounds delicious? Dessert. Any any food really. <laughs> um okay, not all food sounds delicious. I take that back, but uh a lot of food does. Right now I'm actually hungry, so maybe that'll help. Just think of all the foods I want to eat. Uh is pasta here? Because I always want to eat that. Also pizza. No, there aren't two Z's. All right, sounds delicious. Um, what are we doing? Home. I don't think it's going to be home. Let, let's see if we can figure out the spanogram. 
like dessert. Obviously, it's not dessert. There's no D in the entire puzzle. But um, meal, like would it be something meal or a restaurant or cook or chef or I'm, I'm just spitballing here. But or is this like, are we doing with something a little bit more lateral, which because I'm going to have to get some some words for that. Let's look around the edges as well. Turks. <laughs> Tefla. Huh. Does Teflon sound? Deli no, I think Teflon uses an F anyway, and there's no N. Uh, that's the only reason it wouldn't be Teflon. Let's see. I've got stay. Um, I've got stall or stalls. I, 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 I'm not going to try them yet because steak. Oh, okay. I don't know if it's steak or steaks, so I might have one, one mistake here. Okay, it's not steaks. It's words that sound like food, but are actually homophones. Interesting. So I got to think of foods that have homophones. Whew, there's a, there's a, enough of them to make a whole puzzle. It, it is homophones, though. I might have been able to get the spanogram first if I if I had not tried to lock in steak. Um, so what's going on here? Hers Hershey? No, it's, it's always say L L Y. Chili, chili. Ah, chili. Nice. And then, I mean, it's either. Alers or S Esrilla. Which one is it? There's no other way to do it, right? Esrilla or Alers? Eliers? El El Let's get the other ones because I don't know if this. I, no, it, actually, this has to be one word because words are at least four letters long. I think Esrilla sounds better. Ah, oh, darn. Neither of them? Oh, oh, duh. I, I forgot we could take corners like this. I did that last, last game too. Um, Cirilla or Cereal. Cere there we go. Another carousel moment. I keep having carousel moments. All right. What's going on over here? Unfortunately, I can't claim a perfect game because I tried words that weren't true. Um, I, I still haven't gotten any real words, though. Anyway, this game's going to be pretty good. Let let's see what else we've got going on here. <laughs> I'm celebrating a bit early, aren't I? We've got five more words to find. Holy cow, they're short. Didn't realize there were nine words. Usually there's seven. Pita somehow. Meat. And pale? Pale pale, I don't think is a food though. Krill? No. Um okay, does it end in AP or start with PA? Let's do PA. We'd have to go to the I, right? The, the, there's no other way to do this. Pair, obviously. Pair. Okay. Yeah, I knew these would be short words. We still have three words left. How many letters? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 letters. So we've got two four-letter words and a five-letter word. That's the only way that works. So four-letter words. Moat. Time. Oh, time. Yeah, that's okay. We're, we're, we're getting a little bit... Um, Time is not a, a food. It's an herb, but I guess it works. Um, moose. And kale. No? What? Leek. Okay, you can't blame me for kale. That would have also worked. <laughs> All right. Um, cool. Yeah, uh, that, that's an interesting one today. I like this one, actually. I hope you did, too. And uh, how'd you do? Mm -hmm.